Hello everyone, this is Issues from Twitter and uh, there has been, there's a post from someone who is called a catalyst at Amin Lahi who did a post on the uh, on the first lady, Mrs. Aisha Buhari and he said, so mama and she couldn't tell a cow and she meaning that, ah, mama, they don't eat poor people money, they don't, they don't food. He had a picture of her and uh, the next thing this young man has been tracked down, has been arrested from the reports that we are seeing here that he was, he was, he's a 23 year old uh, young man, a final year student of uh, environmental management and toxicology at Federal University, uh, Jigawa State. And that uh, he has been taken away, that he was beaten by security before uh, First Lady. That's the report we are getting. I was later taken to unknown uh, location in Abuja for one week before he was allowed to call his his father his father's name is adamu shalele azari a retired Bochi state uh civil uh, servant uh, and, and 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 all of that and it's really so 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 shameful unlawful i mean aisha buhari should be ashamed of herself absolutely ashamed of herself her husband has thrown 133 million people into multidimensional poverty they have grown, haven't they grown fat over the sweat of Nigerians? While Nigerians have been thrown into multidimensional poverty, they have been thrown into multidimensional wealth. And they are not afraid of flaunting it, of showing it all, all over the place and anyhow. And she dares to come and arrest these young people. Who is she that they will not tell her that she had eaten the, 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 uh, the riches of the poor? Or the money, monies of the poor, or money of the people? Who is she? Or if she's this powerful, why she hasn't she used her power to rescue all the people that are in captivity? A lot of young girls have been in captivity that were taken away from uh, Federal Government College uh, uh, Yauri. And over a year, many of them have given birth there. If Aisha Buhari has this much power that she can go and track somebody down because they said something about her, why didn't she track these people? Why didn't she uh, use that power to track the people that have taken away these girls and bring them back? You use power to oppress the people. You throw people into poverty. You people are, are insecure. People, the, the, the insecurity is affecting them. They can't get, they can't go anywhere. People are dying. People are going through so much hell. And you come and bring your little, I don't even know what to call, little nonsense power and go and arrest a young person because you see him, he's voiceless. He can't talk. If you want to fight somebody, can't you fight somebody your level? Can't you fight somebody so that when they see you fighting somebody, they will know you really actually fought somebody? Is it to go and oppress people out there? Who are you that they will not tell you that you've eaten the, 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 the wealth of the poor and grown fat on it? Who are you that they will not tell you that? You're a public servant and so you will take it if you didn't want to be, to be told that when your husband was contesting, you should have told him that you don't want, to be, you don't, you don't want him to contest. 2019, you went there, you voted for this person who is an absolute, an abysmal failure and yet you're saying that people will not talk. You oppress the people, you use DSS because you have power to use DSS. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I blame Nigerian citizens that gave you a second chance after all the failure that you've done there. This is outrageous. This is, this is, I don't, oh Lord have mercy. I don't even, I don't even know the words to use. I don't blame you. I shall worry. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Now Nigeria I blame. Now Nigeria I blame you. I don't even blame you at all because ordinarily, person like you know suppose get power they take say they go arrest person how dare you how dare you do that to citizens how dare you the office of the citizen is the highest office in the land he has every right to say what he did and if you have any issue with it then go to the courts 